Hello, Living Waters, and welcome to our time of prayer together. Our prayers tonight come from England. Prayers during the outbreak. So we will uh, pray those. Um, yeah. And then if you're joining us for Bingo Nights, that's at 7. Um, Zoom went out on, on uh, Realm. So yeah, if you want to join us for that, win some pie. Uh, it'll be a good time. Uh, it looks like people are on. So let us pray. Keep us good, Lord, under the shadow of your mercy. In this time of uncertainty and distress, sustain and support the anxious and fearful. Lift up all who are brought low. We may rejoice in your comfort, knowing that nothing can separate us from your love. Jesus Christ, you taught us to love our neighbor, to care for those in need as if we were caring for you. Gospel Sunday. In this time of anxiety, give us strength to comfort the fearful, to tend the sick, and to assure the isolated of your of our love and your love. Today we lift up prayers for Ellen, Cody, Josh, Karen, Karen, Sharon, and Brock. Healing for Ida, Susan, Mary Kay, Lorraine, Don, Pedro, Sandy, Jenny, Monica, Robin, Lou, Sue, Sarah, Bob, Yvonne, David, Tammy, Dennis, Frank, Chuck, Kristen, John, Denise, Nadia, Betty, Mary Jane, John, Rosemary, Ben, Spencer, Kim, Lexi, and Jackie. Continue to pray for Kylie, Joyce, Kevin, Mary, and Sarah, the undergo cancer treatments. Pray for peace for Agnes, Noah, Scott, Annette, and Tony. We mourn with the Lynn Farley, with Lynn Rhonda, and the Farley Matthews, Roro, Callahan, Kuta, Nelson, Torres, Sidka, Schweitzer, Stone, Brato, and Zielstra families. Pray for wisdom, for making difficult decisions in this time of year during this pandemic. For all those actively deployed overseas, including Katie. For peace and justice in our nation and world, for Central America as they uh, deal with the impacts of Hurricane Iota. And of course, for an end to COVID-19. We give thanks for the church and this community of faith that keeps us connected when it would be so easy to be completely isolated. God of compassion, be close to those who are ill afraid or in isolation. In their loneliness, be their consolation. In their anxiety, be their hope. In their darkness, be their light. For him who suffered alone on the cross, but reigns with you in glory, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Well, thank you for praying with me tonight, or whenever you're praying. Like I said, bingo at 7 p.m. tonight. That'll be fun. Uh, win some pies, you know, that'll be a good time. Who doesn't like pie? Um, and then, uh, yeah. Oh, I did want to say, though, um, quick update. Uh, please, the Zielster family, please keep them in prayer. Um, Sharon's father passed away earlier in the year, and now her mother has passed away as well. So please keep Sharon in your prayers. Thank you. <laughs>